Hey guys, so it's early morning and I woke up to no power. So let me show you how I handle that at my current uh, home that I'm living at. More when I return on the Eric McNeil Be Free Show. Black men and white men, Jews and Gentiles, Protestants and Catholics will be able to join hands and sing in the words of the old Negro spiritual. Free at last, free at last. Thank God Almighty, we are free at last. Hey guys, welcome. You've just discovered the Eric McNeil Be Free Show, where it's all about being financially independent, responsible for self, enjoying life, and empowering others free. So, on a previous video, I told you how I typically don't drive uh, my car into the compound unless the power goes out. So, um, guess what? The power has went out this morning, and um, so I. Uh, so that's why you know I drove my car into the compound because I told you I don't like driving the car into the compound because of this little stump how they have it. Uh, yeah, it's uh, you know it rubs on the, the the bottom of the car, but um, at any rate, uh, yeah. So um, I am parked in the compound, and I'm gonna show you uh, how I handle when the uh, the power goes out. So basically, when the power goes out, I'll just drive in, and um, I have this device here that I have purchased um, that's just like an inverter. It's like a, you know, a little small power inverter. And um, I can actually just plug this device into my car, right? So I just plug it in. There you go. And that's my inverter. And, uh, you know, I just... Uh, you know, I just hit the power. I don't have to, you know, I don't have to turn it on. But, of course, you know, if you have, like, uh, like, I have two modes, you know, I can hit the button and, uh, and it'll turn it on. And that's the only thing that works. If I hit the button one time, it'll just turn, basically just turn this on. But, you know, of course, if you leave this uh, on too long and you have devices on it, then it will run your battery down. Um, but in, you know, in, in my car, it'll it'll turn that off. It won't leave this on too long. It'll turn it off at about an hour. Um, but then I have another mode. If I hit it again, then it'll activate like the radio and the windows and it'll also turn this on. And in that mode, it will not turn off. So, you know, so if you're running your devices, you have to be, uh, aware that it can run your battery so at you know at some point you just have to uh start your engine so that it it recharges your battery but yeah that's this is all you know you just uh take this and once i take this um i just turn it on like that and if it gets too hot it has a fan a little fan it when it gets uh hot um but yeah so i'm gonna go in and basically just uh take my like what i did is it's kind of dark in here because there's no uh light uh, let me open get, some, get a little light here so what i did is you know i have my wi-fi device right here so this is uh my wi-fi router that's um fiber connected to a fiber line and what i did is i went out and purchased a long extension cord so um and what i'll do is uh you know i have my wi-fi device plugged into it and then um i basically plug my laptop here so you know i'll move closer uh to here so I can work and I'll just take my extension cable and I'll just drag it out to the car so it's a long cable so I just drag it out to the car 
Yeah, and just uh, put it through. Yeah, just come through the window. And basically just take it and plug it in here. Yeah. And voila. And then just turn it on. And there you go. You know, just kind of. Yeah, you see it has a little little light on, let you know it's on. Yeah, so very simple. You can uh, plug your um, USB uh, cables into it. You plug, you know, and different AC ports, depending on what kind you have. And yeah, not much to it, you know. Um, yeah, very simple device. It costs about uh, a good three, maybe three three or four hundred cities not much um yeah so and yeah so as you can see my uh extension cord is is on you can see the uh the lights on it so it's working um my wi-fi device is back on so basically this uh little power inverter will handle um, 200 watts so you know you, um, yeah so it's strong enough to power both my Wi-Fi device and my laptop without a problem and you know and recharge my phones um, and that's that's about all I need yeah okay guys so yeah a very simple device um, it serves a purpose so a lot of times you know here you just have to be creative. Um, like, you know, at the last place, I had a proper um, solar backup, you know, well, not solar, but it was uh, a, you know, I had a proper battery backup system with an inverter connected to it. But on this one, I don't have it. So, you know, you just have to be a little creative um, here. And this is the creative solution, you know. So, you know, until I move out to the site where we have solar, then, I just deal with this but anyway if you like what we're talking about go ahead hit that subscribe well hit that subscribe button like share comment let me know what you think and um, you know um, yeah people might want to know where I found that device I just uh, found it on uh, the site gg uh, dot com dot gh that's j i dot I mean j i j i dot com dot gh is where I looked it up it was like power inverter for your car so um, again go ahead and hit that subscribe button like share comment and if you haven't already done so go ahead and hit the uh, website www.migratingcoachacrossing.com and you still got a little time to take advantage of our half price home promo and um, you know before the year ends guys uh, before the year ends so um, also you can find me on Facebook at Facebook dot com forward slash eric mcneil it's free and as always hoorah ahoo now be free